Welcome to the reading room. Yeah. Welcome to the reading room. Yes, yeah. dog. Welcome to the reading room. Welcome to the reading room. Yeah. Welcome to the reading room. Get ready. Welcome yeah. Welcome to the reading room. It's tough. Yeah. Read, read, read. She said what? She did. Who? She did who? Oh, Miss Thing, that was. Back to the reading room, ATL. You hear one of your hosts, Denzel. And I am Jason Jones. And I am Marilyn Monroe. Come on, oh, Marilyn. Push through. Push yes, through. And here we are again, one of our sites we like to call Urban Word. It's where we give our perspective on the words that people come up with in today's society. Okay. Mm -hmm. And for me this week, I'm going to go with the word designated drunk. Oh. The designated drunk is the individual like myself. <laughs> You know, we have those designated drivers, don't get confused with that. Mm -hmm. The designated driver, they don't drink the whole night. The designated drunk is the one who makes sure they don't drink the whole night. <laughs> you know, when somebody hands you a drink or tries to offer the designated drunk driver a drink, you're the one that says, okay, I'll just, I got you. I got you. I'll, oh, I like I'll that. Take that. So, you know, they don't, you know. I'll be that drunk at all. He, you know? he plays that all Very well. All <laughs> very well. <laughs> very well. But that's me, the designated drunk. I make sure our designated driver does not. Okay, I like that. And he in turn is getting drunk. <laughs> and I have to drive home. That's <laughs> Jesus. That's <laughs> the adults. So my urban word for this week is ask ho. Ask ho? Not an asshole. Oh. Not to be confused. Okay. But ask. these are equally as assish. But these are <laughs> this person's called an ask ho. So it's a person who constantly asks for advice, yet always does the direct opposite oh, God. of what the person asks them to do. Or AKA food. <laughs> what was the what you asked for my opinion for? Oh when especially when you get such seasoned, colorful, wise advice from a sage like myself. <laughs> oh god. And it's just call him Mr. Owl. <laughs> <laughs> and so the, the, just the ask call, they ask you all these things, you give them all this one advice and they do our the opposite. What they really are looking for is for someone to co-sign on their foolishness. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. right? And I'm not a co-signer of foolishness or any other thing that's for me. So the cosign that you want me to do ain't gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. So and you sometimes ask I just like to bust your bubble. Come on and ask Ooh. me. I'm gonna tell you exactly <laughs> what you don't want. Me. And you know what the gag on the whole thing is? The when it, the shit hits the fan, they're like, "Oh, I should have listened to you." Hey. That's why I came to my. Girl, that's why I came this. You know, girl. That's why your mattress is still on the floor. Ooh. Now so, it's time for my <laughs> urgent word. <laughs> So this uh, word was actually coined last summer, okay. but I thought it'd be appropriate just in case, you know, people haven't been on their diet plans and whatnot, okay. that okay. they may end up with dad bod. So this was trending when, you know, a man may not have a six pack, child may not even have a two pack, more like a little keg going on, <laughs> and more like some little, just yeah, a little bit of man boo bitch, <laughs> and you know, so when he stands, you just, and especially to the profile, you get that little right there. But a lot of young women were trending dad bod and finding it very hot, finding it very sexy. So some of your uh, popular dad bods of last summer was Leonardo DiCaprio. He, had, he took five hot blondes to a private secluded island and they're all toned and have bikinis on and firm booties and everything shaking and bouncing and he had dad bod but I well you know I just maybe when you have a certain amount of money you can have dad bod I don't and know if the kids is going to let you I don't know if the kids going to let you walk around Not and come in bulldogs with no dad bod but, get you wrong. but nobody you know but you know sometimes people like not a daddy healthy. but a dad Mm -hmm. And you know, you find like, that you know, I, like I have a really good look. friend. Mm -hmm. A really good friend. He used to be part of the show. He he likes that look. He likes dads. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not looking for no motherfucking Carl Winslow. I'm gonna tell y'all that now. <laughs> I need a full I don't six, want, 18 pack in here. I don't want Dr. Huxtable. I don't want Dr. Huxtable. None of those. None of those. Child. Uh, you go to over to the young, the restless, and find what I need. Give me an old Malcolm, <laughs> a Neil, or something and like that. Yeah, okay. That dad bod. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm -mm. So that is. Well, I, no, I, I'm lying actually. Oh, she likes it. Chunk. Now that I think about it, chunks and all. Yeah, so yeah, mo, cause you know, you know, with the studs being female, okay. they can't help but have a little fat in places. You know okay. what I'm saying? Okay. And they're basically okay. trying to be all kind of working out, eating pizzas and lettuce. They'd be worse than us on the diet, it's trying to get down to what you know guys <laughs> can naturally look like. Right. But especially of a certain age, females are just gonna have fat in certain areas, which I like. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind it 
Oh, my hips. Oh, my hips. Oh, okay, grab them. Around the Even right in the areas. stomach area. I like a little tummy. You know, it's something about a little tummy under here. I know. Oh, so. It's wonderful. Okay. So, I might not take Carl Winslow, but I'll take his wife. <laughs> and that's that. Come to Winslow. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's that. All right. And. Thank you for watching The Reading Room ATL. We are excited to announce we are giving away a hoverboard. Watch this short clip for instructions on how to win. Good luck. Welcome to The Reading Room. Yeah. Welcome to The Reading Room. Yes, yeah. go. Welcome to The Reading Room. Oh. Welcome to The Reading Room. Here we yeah. go. Welcome to The Reading Room. Get ready. Welcome yeah. Welcome to The Reading Room. It's coming. Yeah. Read, read, read. read.